This is BV I Channel One. I still remain Asu Zuchinodu Peters. Today, after the um, leadership training being put together by the customary government of Indigenous Pool of Biafra, I decided to single out a man that made a statement during the leadership training. And BV I Channel One have identified this man to ask him critical questions so that you and I we understand where he's coming from and where he's heading to so just sit right there don't touch that buffing don't just grow outside this channel because what you're about to hear will twinkle your ears i still remain as the peters and stay connected to bvi channel one don't go away hello sir it's a pleasure to meet you um can you please tell us your name I am Apostle Nduchem J. Mbazurike. Okay, um, today you came uh, to the leadership training put together by the customary government of indigenous people of Biafra. We would like to understand from your opinion, what do you think customary government is all about relating it to indigenous people of Biafra? Well, the creator of heaven and earth, the sea and all that is in them, created all people of, the, of, of every nation and uh, allowed them to develop themselves based on what they believe. And in the process of time, God chose a people for himself that we know today as Israel and gave them sets of laws by which they will govern themselves. Put their society right, do the right things, ensure that justice is done, that the rights of people are given to them, that the rich take care of the poor, that love abound in their midst, that nobody goes about gossiping, being a tail bearer. God gave them so many laws that will make them a people to be envied by other nations. How does that concern the customary government of indigenous people of Biafra? Well, the, the Igbo nation, as we know, have their culture, which they have been practicing before the Europeans came with their own religion. What kind of culture is that? Can you give us um, some highlight on it? Well, the, the Igbo nation had been practicing, had been doing things that, astonishingly, when we came in contact with, with the Bible, we discovered that those things that the Igbo nation has been doing before the Europeans came, that all of them are in the Bible in the Torah, the Old Testament. That's, that, be, that's before the white men came with Bible. Yes, before the white men came with the Bible. Let me give you an example. The Igbo nation circumcised their male children on the eighth day. And when the Bible came, we discovered that God also told the children of Israel to circumcise their male on the eighth day. The Europeans didn't, didn't teach us that. Our people have been doing it. And also in the Igbo land, our people have been, you know, uh, 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 having a culture of love. They love themselves. They live the communal life. They do things together. An example is this. 
that in Igbo land, the Igbos, when they plant crops, they don't harvest everything during the harvest season. They leave some for the poor. And the poor will go in and harvest. And nobody will call them thief. Um, that kind of um, culture, that kind of uh, norms and value, is that, can that be, uh, 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 be said of of the current Igbo nation at this time? No, 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 no. Religion has taken all these things away from us. What kind of religion? The, what they call the Christian religion today. So you mean the Bible is not a Christian religion? Because you said that the, the Bible they brought, the, the, the Biafran or the Igbo culture is already written there. So where is the misplacement? This, the misplacement is that those who brought the religion, the white who brought the religion, didn't teach our people what God said or what is written in the scriptures. They brought their own teaching and replaced it with the teachings of the Torah, of the scriptures. That is why we had problem. And what are the roles of uh, or the role of the, um, the, the churches at the present time with respect to, the, to all this? The role of the church is to turn back and teach the people the truth. Because Jesus said, when you know the truth, the truth shall set you free. Currently, are the churches doing that at the moment? Nowhere. They are not teaching our people what the Almighty have instructed. So what are they doing? They, they, they are teaching their own teachings, which we, uh, they know as church doctrine and not the doctrine of Jesus Christ. So, uh, what can the customary government do to retrace all that? What the customary government will do, as the name entails, is that they will have to sensitize the people to know that we don't need the white people to teach us about God. We have known God before the white men came. And um, uh, to know about our norms and values. Yes! I think that is the original principle or standard of God. Yes! That God loves righteousness. He loves loving... He loves loving kindness and judgment and these are the things that are lacking in nigeria presently and even in the church you won't find any of these virtues so you mean the biafran agitation for self-determination through the customary law administration is justified justified 100 percent. thank you for giving us your time thank you. that is it for today's edition don't forget to subscribe to bvi channel one follow us on all our social media platforms just like you see right there on the screen Join us in all our activity. Don't forget to be part of the Biafran Revolution. Be part of history. Because that is what BVI Channel 1 is bringing right to your doorstep in a click of a button. I still remain as Peters and I love you to the bones.